Ian Marshall is a Kent, Ohio-based painter and photographer. Originally from the small Cuyahoga River town of Kent, Marshall spent many years carefully observing the town and watching many changes which unfolded, along with the changes including a rebirth of elements, the discarding of withering materials, and their replacement, the neogenesis of industrialization. Ian has received numerous awards throughout Northeast Ohio, such as acceptance into the GAR Foundation in Akron, along with Best of Show at Art in the Park in Kent. Ian has also shown at 78th Street Studios in Cleveland. Marshall completed his bachelor's in fine arts program with a concentration in painting from Kent State University in May 2017. To quote the artist, my photography explores areas in Kent, Ohio, composing of industrial, aged, natural, and complex qualities. I am drawn to intricate industrial, architectural, and natural forms occurring in the 3D realm of life and transcribing them into a two-dimensional composition. The industrial nature of my photos reflect the once heavily trafficked area, now at a quiet standstill of overgrowth, overabundance of rustic development, and withering materials. My night photos explore another side of this town, a sort of serenity and isolation that I investigate over and over again. My hunt for long exposure train shots are something more of an experience rather than simple photo hunting. The long cargo trains roar through the thick foliage surrounding the Cuyahoga River, acting as a sort of lifeblood traversing the local arteries. I am rarely disappointed. These shots have a special theme slot reserved for them. They are part of my Midnight Metroliner series. The natural side of my photography delves into intense lighting alongside rich colors which are only activated through sunrises and sunsets, golden hours. I find a pleasing amount of beautiful color found in smooth gradients in the sky, extending from horizon to beyond. This lighting is powerful stuff. Not only does it encapsulate the color and intricacies of objects in my perimeter, such as a spider web or strong intense shadows, it is also a personal reminder of just how beautiful an everyday object can be if you give them the time of day. I consider my photographic element to be the backbone of my paintings. I view my oil paintings as abstracted blueprints for architectural segments occurring in my hometown of Kent and abroad. 
My compositions are derived from my heavy photographic observations of industrial aspects, including interesting lineage elements, fantastic gradients found in the reflective quality of metal, and hard edge shapes to weigh down compositions in a balancing manner. I utilize imposed color to augment the basic and generic nature of industrial surfaces and textures. Jungle and 